So today I've been spending some time working on this styrofoam drawing on and off. And this is the last side I need to work on before it's completely finished. I should finish it either today or early on tomorrow. And uh, this is where I am at currently in regards to my city in Elvenar. And today was the day early on around... I think it was around 8 in the morning... or maybe around 7 in the morning, I decided to revive the Rough Men gameplay series. Since I saw that that one of the original five the one of the Fetch with Rough Rumping gameplay of Disco Fever was still one of my top videos after All these years. So, since I knew that. PBS had changed the Fetch with Rough Ruffman website. I at first thought about going on the Internet Archive's Wayback Machine in order to access the old Flash-based version of the Fetch with Ruff Ruffman website. And it, that was how I initially found it. And I believe that was around the time I got the idea to do the game I ended up picking. Picking for today, which was the game Roller Coaster. I got the idea to use my registered version of Bandicam to record the gameplay. It took me just a minute max to set up my microphone onto Bandy cam.
it seems the microphone captures not only my voice, but some kind of background noise. So it's kind of like a throwback to 2013. I did some tests to see if what I had done initially would go smoothly and They captured my voice just fine. So the second test was to see if closing the window would get rid of the background noise, but it didn't, so I just reopened it. I beat the first two levels of the game in 18 minutes before her dad uh, interrupted me by calling me. And uh, this was at around 9 in the morning. It was a pretty enjoyable call. I mean, already at 18 minutes, it ended up being the longest of the Ruffman gameplays. Excuse me. Longer than any of the original five. Uh, that Ruffman gameplay video is currently my best performing video. I had that half of the meatball sub with black olives and banana peppers dad got me at around 2 p.m. As I was still working on the styrofoam drying on and off. That Washington DC cup after I drank the cold brew I then filled it with pineapple juice and then tap water from the sink. In the bathroom.
in particular, I did that in an effort to either relieve heartburn or in the case of the second time I got tap water to relieve the bad taste I got in my mouth when a bit of bile got up there and I felt something through my nose but nothing really came out but I spat in the sink of the bathroom to get rid of the bile infused spit I recall in the morning dad gave me three fortune cookies to go with The, the morning coffee. And these are the fortunes I got with them. And I had already taken a picture of them in the morning. Uh, this is the cheesecake that Dad initially planned on getting yesterday. It looks pretty good. And is part of... the birthday celebrations. It tastes pretty good, and I like the strawberry filling it has to it. I came up with the pier slash dock pattern because on the previous... Styrofoam drawing similar to this, I had done a sort of road pattern. So I needed to do something something different, but it still needed to sort of fit with the whole ski resort pattern I did for those previous sides. And then I figured I could over these indentations along this side I could sort of serve as branching off piers to go with a sort of pond pattern which is why I drew all these lily pads I currently have plans to throw in some lotus flowers along with all the lily pads. And maybe for the rest, maybe I'll throw in a motorboat and a fishing boat of sorts. Those are the potential ideas, at least. In terms of finishing this, 
styrofoam drawing. It'll be finished either today, of which it's currently 8, 12 p.m., or early on tomorrow. Uh, maintenance workers were supposed to arrive to either fix or replace the furnace today, but uh, they never ended up arriving. Uh, the expectations of the maintenance workers... Could it at least be a potential factor into as why it called me around 9 in the morning?